Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make miniature waffles. First start out by conditioning a light tan color. Then roll that into a flat sheet. Then add texture to the surface by tapping it all over with a toothbrush. Then to make the indentions in the waffle, use the flat end of a matchstick and press lightly into the clay. Continue to do that until you have four across and four down. Make two sets of this for each waffle you want. Then cut off the excess clay from each edge. Then make another cut to divide each set. Texture the edges with the toothbrush. Then use a needle tool to rough up the texture a little more. I even poked a hole in one of the indentions. It's good to use a reference picture for something like this. Then add shading with chalk pastels to give it a nice toasted look. Start with yellow and work your way up to a brown. Do this for the front and edges of each of your waffle pieces. Then flip one of them over. If you want this to be a charm, this is the time to add a head pin or an eye pin. I used an eye pin and measured about where I needed the loop to go. Then cut and placed it in the middle of my waffle half. If you don't want it to be a charm, just skip the eye pin or head pin and go ahead and add the second half onto the first half of the waffle. To make the two halves more secure, I pressed a match stick back into some of the indentions. For the syrup mix, chalk pastels in liquid clay. Be sure to mix thoroughly, and it's good to use a more clear or translucent liquid clay. Add more chalk pastels or more liquid clay as you feel necessary. Then drop the syrup onto the top of your waffles. Let it pull for a while, and then you can go back and spread it out a little bit more to your liking. To make things easier on yourself, do this on a bakeable surface, so you can go ahead and put that straight into the oven when you're done. When you are done, bake it according to your clay's package instructions. Allow them to cool completely before handling. You might need to take a blade and slide it under gently to give you a little more assistance pulling them off the tile. I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you so much for watching.